and Leela Rose just tipped out all the lollipop sticks. Mayla Rose! vlog it is not a meal or a me vlog for once I know that's just about all I do at the moment um, but it is actually about Mila it is about her first birthday party and I'm going to be showing you all of the cutesy little things I've been picking up over the past month or two um, in preparation for her birthday party um, a lot of the stuff I've bought I have bought online or I've got from Uncle Bill's which is an amazing store for getting really cheap party stuff um, but I source most of my stuff online uh, Mela Rose is up here in her cot she might throw some stuff out at me so just be warned and Roman's over there so um, he may come in and out of the camera as well. Alright so I mean a lot of these things I'm just going to show you real quick snippets of them um, you'll be able to see them in more detail in the actual birthday party vlog but this is just a real quick look at some of the stuff I've put together just because I thought maybe you might be interested. Uh, hello. Hi. Hi. Okay so firstly this stuff here is um, basically the plastic tablecloth you can buy in packets that already fit a trestle table but um, I think it's just easier to buy these rolls because you can do so much more with it. Um, it is this long which I think is 90 centimeters and it's 25 meters. 25 meters of this stuff which is awesome because I don't use it just for tablecloths. I use it to drape from the ceiling. That's what I'm going to be doing with her party anyway. Um, <laughs> In the past, I've used it to drape over windows, from doors, um, to make table runners, to make sashes for chairs. Like, this stuff has so many uses, and it was only 11 bucks. Also, along the same lines, is I have this beautiful pink organza and this white organza. Um, purely to do things like bows. Um, we are having the birthday party at our house. Normally, normally we have the parties um, at the church lounge rooms, but they're currently booked. So we're just going to have it at our house. Um, and we have a nice generous sized deck with so many spaces that I can use the stuff to do bows and just intertwine it on the railings. Like, I just cannot wait to get using it. Is that right? So her okay, theme so is over. pink, white, a um, little bit of mint and sparkle. So basically pink and sparkly, that's basically her party. So we've also got pink cup, pink polka dot straws, which these were from Uncle Bill's, the cups were from Uncle Bill's. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's just grabbing stuff left right and centre. Um, this is the tablecloth I was telling about. So these size here, you pay like two, three dollars for this, and um, so it's it's much cheaper just to buy that whole roll. But there is a striped one here too. Um, I'll probably might even use this as a backdrop. Not sure yet. I do a lot of my planning and setup on the actual day, so I can't really tell you what I'm going to use this for, but I will always find a use for it. Along the same lines is I've got my pink plates. I've got my pink and white napkins here. Um, I've got these big hanging puff balls, they're called. These are big 40 centimeter ones, these are, these are massive. So, um, I need to get a whole bunch more that are of the small size because I want to do, um, basically I want to hang this stuff from the ceiling, like, to make it, like, go like this. Oh my gosh, my explaining skills are absolutely great here. Um, and then in the centre of, the, like, the tea, I guess you'd say, I want to have a whole bunch of these and different colours of the white, pink and the mint and sizes in the middle. Just like a really cute centrepiece thing on the ceiling going on. Um, bunting. Um, this is from Uncle Bill's, cost me a couple of bucks, and there are, like, 50 of these triangles in here, and they've all got, like, pink things, but they've got some of them got stars, some of them got stripes, some of them got um, little polka dots, yada 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 yada. Oh, also from Uncle Bill's, these are like cake pop boxes, so basically it's a box and inside the box it's got like cellophane or something to hold your sticks up, um, and it's got the holes already in it to put, oh I can actually show you something, I made these last night, 
So these are, oh my goodness, now my child is going under the cot. So these are number, so these are a cute chocolate one um, that I made last night just with compound chocolate, glitter, um, I've got a lollipop stick, a little cellophane bag, and a uh, ribbon, and that's made this. Anyway, so that's why these boxes are for. Stuff like that. There you go, sits up in it. Perfect! I got two of those boxes, and here's all my little ones I made last night. So, pop them in a bag. So I also got heaps of these sticks, so I got medium sized sticks, I got big sticks, and I got little sticks somewhere, oh there, little baby baby sticks. And these are the cellophane bags that I put over the top of the chocolates, they cost me like 2 or 3 dollars or something from Kmart. I always buy these teaspoons from Pack and Save, they're really itty bitty baby teaspoons, and I got those because I like to make a whole bunch of um, miniature desserts, so I got these really cute disposable dipping bowls that I'm going to be putting like individual little desserts in them, so that's where these tiny wee teaspoons come in handy. Online I got these really cute cookie cutters, they're like vintagey shapes and um, I'm going to be put, putting Mila's initials in them and making them really cute and vintagey. This here is a um, fondant like mould, it is to make edible lace. So I'm going to be using that on her. I'm going to be using that on her birthday cake. Um, we've got little white cupcake cases here, and then I got these really, really cute lacy cupcake um, like wrappers. So they look like this. <laughs> One moment, please. I can't get it done. Yeah. Yeah, I'll try. Oh, that's no, right. Mummy got it. Thanks for your help anyway, Roman. So, these gorgeous lacy cupcake cases, which these kind of sit into. Right, we have these sticks. You probably think, what the heck do you have these random sticks for? But, I'm going to be putting candy floss on them, and then, like the same with the chocolate, I'm going to be putting the plastic, uh, the little bag over the top with the little bow. Just oh, so it's really cute! And Brendan's going to draw some bigger holes in one of those boxes for me. So these can stick in and just look really cute with a whole bunch of pink candy floss. So far I have like food. This is mostly the party stuff, not the food, but I've got a couple of food items in here. We've got the, this vanilla instant dessert and strawberry instant dessert. Um, so these are going to be to go in these little dessert case things with like brown and stuff like that. Uh, here we have Mila Rose's cake topper. So this little one was actually in her cake smash cake, and then we've got this M. How pretty is that? And it's all sparkly. It is gorgeous. So that is going to be on the top of her cake. I'm going to be having a candy bar for her birthday party. So I have, I have two of these scoops for the candy bar. Um, we have these cute little glasses here. I've got a whole bunch of different sized jars. We made this with the Cricut. Um, and all these lollies are really expensive, so I cheated. And there's actually a glass in there holding most of them up to the wall. Especially for these big ones, like they're really expensive to fill, but I do have smaller ones. Which um, I just filled, like those are snowballs. And this one's gumball. So these smaller ones weren't as expensive to fill, but they, I just think they're so cute. I've got a whole bunch of these with different lollies in them. I didn't actually want to drag them all out to show you guys, so you'll see them at the party anyway. Um, we have these two cake boards, again from Uncle Bill's, pink and white polka dot. Um, these are for cakes, but I'm actually going to use them as serving platters, and from my gender reveal party I have two round ones of these, which I'll also be using as like serving platters. I have these mini meringue nests. I do actually know how to make these myself, but just to save myself some time and stress, I brought them pre-made, so I think I think these will look really cute with some pink cream in them. Lastly, the, oh no, second to lastly, sorry. Um, I have all these jars, which I'm going to fill with um, pink milk, um, strawberry milk, and um, I did that for my baby shower and it just looks so effective with like the little straw hanging out and, and another cool thing to display and Mila Rose just tipped out all the lollipop sticks. Mila Rose! Oh my gosh! And lastly, the last thing I have to show you is I just grabbed a few things for a piñata, so I bought a... <laughs> I just thought... Oh, yeah, I just made a book. 
let's just throw everything around everywhere because that's what I seem to be doing. I bought a pinata stick, three bucks from Kmart, can't go past it. Um, I have these two infinity scars to go and pass the parcel. Um, but bubbles, because every kid loves the bubbles. I want one My bubbles. for me. So one of these is probably going to be for the kids to use while they're at the party or in the pass the parcel or something like that. You just buy a whole bunch. These are like a dollar each. You just buy a whole bunch of cute kids stuff and you can use them for a whole bunch of different things. Whether it's pass the parcel or prizes or whatever. These are five bucks from Kmart and it's full of lots of different lollies and that is going to be going in the piñata. Alright guys, that it is it for all of the things that I've got for Mila Rose's birthday party so far. No doubt in the next two weeks until her party I'm going to be buying so much more. But that's just what I've got so far. Let me know what you think and if there's anything you think I should be buying that I've forgotten. Um, because I'm a bit of an earhead at the moment. <laughs> Thanks guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe and share my video with somebody who's going to have a cute girly birthday party too. Alright, see you guys.